gives Sabalski a little three on three, ready to go. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dot. Well, the hype for this one has been off the hook. Puck is dropped. Let's see if this one actually lives up to it. And now he moves it quickly to Pedersen. Feeds the puck to Norris. Moved in front! And that's a paddling from the goaltender. Won it in their own end. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Moves the puck. Scores! Listen to this place. What a start for them. To get the game's first goal, now they have to keep the pressure on. Vancouver's on the board here, and they've got the home crowd right into it early. Aggressively out of the gate. They didn't give the opponent any time to get settled at all. I love their start. Scoops up the puck here. Into the offensive end now. Sends it over. Whiffs on that. Trying to shake the defender. He's in all alone. And brings it off the post. Oh, that's a bad sound to hear. You make a good shot, you beat the goalie, and the puck's coming. He scores! They tied it up! Brand new game. All that work that's gone behind this, and we're back to even Steven. He's tight to the net. He doesn't have much time. And that snapshot beats the goaltender from the low slot. Still lots of time left here in this frame. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. James wins the draw. Taken by Reeves. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Maintains possession. It's a two-on-one. Scores! They barely fished the puck out after the last one. Two goals in 70 seconds. You take a timeout here on the other side. I would have taken one then, and I'd take another one now. Detroit's got the one goal lead here in the opening frame. Better to be ahead than behind, and the coaches are telling them that they want more aggression. They want them to play more in the offensive zone. Bacon Country's on the attack. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Makes the save. Sends it quickly to Pedersen. Puck lands right back onto the blade. Comes up with the stop. And another stop. Vancouver's grabbed a hold of the puck. And there it is, but wait a second. They're waving this one off. I don't think this should count either, James. The play is waved off immediately. Cat's not going to be very happy with this. They've waved this off. This looks pretty clearly like goalie interference. Detroit's capitalized on their offensive abilities here in this first period. Reeves moves the puck. And now he tries to get it across to James. The Banner Baggers get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Outstanding save and a huge opportunity. Denies him again. Quick work. He makes one and two saves in a row. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Vancouver's still down a goal here, but they have really picked up the tempo these last few minutes. Moves it quickly over to Cat. Takes a shot, and the lane's clogged up blocking that. Norris plays it now. And tries to make a diagonal pass to James. And we've got a two-on-one. Chaps the puck away, and he'll go to center ice for the penalty shot. Trying to get to the puck, he reaches his stick right into the guy's feet, and down he goes. And the shooter lines up, here we go. Makes the stop under pressure. Man, he's so composed in there, doesn't look under stress at all, and makes a really straightforward save. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Detroit's gained possession along the boards. The Banner Baggers pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Good defensive effort to poke it away. 
Vancouver's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. There's the whistle icing the call. Here in the late going of the frame, it's 2-1. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Icing being waved off just a good old-fashioned sprint. You go as fast as you can, you try to take the shortest route to the puck. He gets there and the icing's waved away. Gets that puck back on a stick. Off target! Bacon Country's got the puck along the boards. Look out, a two-on-one! Puck grabbed by Pedersen. He scores! What an effort to get this game back to level. You've got to continue to work even when you trail in the game. They did that, and now they have a brand new game to play. He drops into the butterfly to try and take away as much of the net as he can, but the shooter's got enough time to find some room. He sees it, and he doesn't miss. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. Scores! Oh, that was a beauty! Hard to get away quicker than that. A pair of goals in 40 seconds. Conversely, deflating for the other team. Man, that is a kick in the shins right there. They just couldn't stop the bleeding. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Well, that'll do it for period number one and a chance for both teams to kind of get a refresh here. A high-scoring affair through the first 20 minutes of play. We'll see if the intermission will calm both teams down here. But I'll tell you what, I love this offense. heading down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. are back at center ice and we are ready to get period number two underway. Here we go, middle frame now underway as the puck drops. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? Bacon Country's puck possession was pretty dismal in that first period. They'd have the puck and then they were like a turnover machine. They're lucky it's close. And there's the save. And there it is. Penalty shot the call. A little bit of frustration there. He's out of position, and he gets called for slashing. Big save, and breathe a sigh of relief. Nowhere to go. The puck's got no lane into the net. The goalie does an outstanding job. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. 3-2 is where we're sitting. Excellent stick work on the play. Quick feed to Norris. Oh, Scores! The captain delivers! Oh, it just trickles over the goal line. The goaltender stopped most of it, just not all of it. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Sends it across the ice. Over the line they come. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. Icing is called, stopping the play dead. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Detroit's got a hold of it against the wall. Can't get it to go. From the left wing, takes the feed. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. 
still lots of time left in the period. It's all tied up. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Taken along the wall by Reeves. Inside the defensive zone, moving the puck. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Stopped with ease. Picked up along the boards by Pedersen. Bacon Country's got it in the neutral zone. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Oh. Scores! The captain comes through! Actually, James, it's amazing to me how many times an odd man rush gets screwed up. They deliver this one perfectly, and they put one on the board. Grabs the puck at center. Gets in front of it. Drives into the front of the net. Big save by the goaltender once again. With the backhander, and that's blocked away. Detroit's got a hold of it along the wall. Quick feed down low. Pedersen's gonna play the puck behind the cage. Stopped by the goaltender. Dead center, excellent save. Reeves carries the puck in his own zone. And it's a quick pass to James. It's a two on one. Puts it on goal, and that one's turned away. Past the halfway mark of this period, the Banner Bangers are hanging on to this one goal lead. They'd love to add another. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Big save. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Passes over to Pedersen. Oh boy, here comes a three on one. Brings the iron. The one time rocket just wide. They say it's a game of inches, James. If that puck is a couple of inches to the side, that hits the post and goes in. And the linesman calls icing on the play. Here in the dying moments of this period, it's a one goal game at this point. 4-3 is the score. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And that's just out of reach. Moves it around along the half wall. Slides it diagonally to James. Less than a minute to go here in the second. And now it's over to James. Moves the puck along the half wall. Stopped by the goaltender. What do you think hurts more? He's got a headache or his jaw's sore? That thing was a bullet. <laughs> As soon as that third goal went into the net. Vancouver's made their way back to center ice. What's the message here as they take a two-goal lead late here? Don't change anything. Stay aggressive. Get the puck deep. Be really sure if you're going to pass it through the middle of the ice. Hard sounds bringing the second period to an end. in store for the third period. Let's tune in to find out just moments away. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James, and we are ready to kickstart this third period. It's been quite the night of fireworks thus far. Let's see what this third period can do to keep up. 
Trying to shake the defender. The official signals penalty shot. Here we go. One on one with the goalie. Scores! That's three. I have nine of these, James. It is such a cool thing to score three. You feel so good about yourself. Detroit's third period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. He's third of the game. They've got numbers. Number 21, time of the goal. On the attack along the boards. Find some space in the corner. And that's picked off in front. Heads Woo! deep scores. What a counter punch. Wow, that didn't take very long after giving up a goal. They get right back onto the attack. Vancouver's off to a great start to this period as they extend the lead. Puck hit the ice and they were aggressive right from the beginning. I like the way that they played the first bit of this third period. Now they have a little bit more of a comfortable cushion. And takes a tour out of the offensive end to find some space at center. Denied by the goaltender. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. Blocker save. Well positioned save and he has the rebound over in the corner. Bacon Country's got the puck along the wall. The Banner Baggers have it in the offensive end. Right to the middle, blocked in traffic. This has been a heck of a shift for them. They've got them hemmed into the offensive zone. Now they can carry the puck around as the defenders are just gonna play a tight box. They look exhausted. And now he moves it to Pedersen. Offside is the call, but we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. Vancouver's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Here's a short pass to Cat. Sends it across. Great defensive effort with the strip. Picked off in the open ice. One on one with the goaltender. What a stop by the goalie. Yeah, he looked really confident. Out on top of the crease, followed the shooter and made the stop. What a steal in his own end. Moves it to Pedersen. And we've got a two-on-one. Scores! The captain delivers! Vancouver's all too aware there's no mercy rule in hockey. They continue to apply the pressure. No, they're laying a beating on these guys now. It may be time to lay back just a bit. Quick snap! Gives them nothing in front. He's sharp on this one, out on top of the crease, aggressively to make the save. And he comes up with a huge stop. Slides it over with pace to James. Knocked away. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. Pass right back. Here they are on the attack. Stays with it. And that's blocked. Denied by the puck stopper. The Banner Baggers have shown no signs of slowing down here in this third period. Up oh, big. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Takes it across the blue line to his teammate. Oh, and he misses an opportunity there. Looking to be too perfect. Get it on the net. You've got a better chance to squeak one through the goaltender than if you miss it outside the net. And now it's grabbed by Pedersen. Backhander in front, blocker saved by the goalkeeper. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Detroit's got the puck along the boards. Vancouver's got possession here in the offensive Whoa. zone. And his goaltender's not going to like that one as he scores, putting it into his own net. I'm almost certain, James, he was looking to clear that puck anywhere else than where it went, right behind his own goalie. Setters jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Right up front, scores! The captain comes through! Vancouver's 
Bucks having a lot of fun out there tonight, but Ray, I can imagine it's a different story on the other side of the bench. Yeah, half the guys out here are having fun. The other half, this game can't end quick enough. Look out, a two-on-one. Grabs it in his own end. Let's the wrister go. Easily turned away by the goaltender. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. Vancouver's up big time here in the late stages of this third period. Under a minute to go in the third. Detroit's got control of it now from their own end. Quick feed to Norris. There's the whistle icing the call. Vancouver's put in one of their most complete efforts that we have seen in quite some time. Up big time late in this third. Let's it go! Just wide! Detroit's looking to break out of their own end. Angles it over to Norris. One-on-one -on -one with the goaltender! And can't convert! Can't convert, James. He doesn't even get a shot. He might as well dump it in the corner and keep the forecheck going. Long lead pass into the neutral zone. Gets it out of his own end. Ahead of steam now towards the front. And he comes up with it. The banner bangers are going to want to bring this big lead home late in the third. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Takes the feed. Ray, more shots, more offense, and they converted. They dominated the game start to finish. You got a feel for the losing goaltender. He had to feel like he was at the end of a firing squad there. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us tonight.